once more into the fray we go but nor no sooner did we get back down to the swamp area then the seasons changed so now we are freezing our little tiny took us off uh we need a campfire post that right the haste now uh what are we missing what are we missing resin i uh, just passed some here it is we need to drop ourselves a campfire and warm up we probably should build a small outpost here while we're at it it seems like the smart thing to do and it'll also be a good idea to have a repair bench and a bed in case I die. Which is very, very likely to happen since we're in spider hell. Okay, I don't want to swap to the cold protection gear. It's not worth it to me because I'd be losing too much defense. I want to make, um, I want to make my life as tanky as possible. Yeah, that should warm me up, right? Okay, yeah, if I stand literally on top of it, it warms me up. Okay, uh, in that case, I could do three fiber foundations. Let's do my snap here. Just I'm going to break you. I just want to do that, and then we're going to break. We're going to have a little hearth going. Operation Outpost is a success. We've uh, had enough like kind of things that we could deforce in the area to get an outpost up and running relatively quickly. And I also went to the trouble of getting a, a stone cutter station built because I wanted to make the flint shears. I'd forgotten about doing this when we were back at the Great Tree, but if there's some flint, we have everything else stored away. If we if there's some flint down in the swamp, which I believe there might be, if I remember correctly. Uh, then we're pretty, we're pretty golden. Oh, there's a spider right there. Then we're pretty golden because we could just come back up here, make the, um, make the shears and then see what's in the sack. But here it is. This is going to, this is going to begin our, uh, our farming spree. Hopefully it's, I thought it was dead. Hopefully it's, uh, not going to be a very short lived one. We're going to be out here basically until we, oh, what's this? Is this an explorable cave? Oh my god, it is. I didn't notice this until right now. This is kind of cool. Oh, I didn't make any band-aids either. Uh, poop. I can't rely on food to heal me. Let's explore this and then go make some band-aids. Totally forgot about the band-aids. Um, yeah, flint. We need flint, make shears, get cocoons. Need, uh, just need to go out, farm a little bit until we get cold and then find some place that's comfortable. But it looks like I'm sheltered in here. So I could be... I could be utilizing this to my advantage. Oh, this seems like a shortcut. Where did that take us? Neat. Took us down to this little area. Well, let's follow this path. Maybe we can kind of carve out a little area for us to traverse to and from. I didn't notice that there was like a little cave there, though. That's kind of cool. What about this one? This looks like another cave. Is this, um... Usually these are like little bug spawn points. Yeah, I think that's a, a bug spawn point. Not an actual cave. Hey, what's up, dude? Let's try to be good here. Dodge at the sound cues. Yep, we dodge at the sound cues. We don't get hit. Oh, I got hit. Oop. All right, what do we? What do we got? Full spider. Oh, there was stamp. Let me drink. I made some stamp potions. Insect fur. I want silk. I need the silk. Do we? How much do we have? I haven't gotten any. I killed two wolves and gotten zero silk. Let's drink my stamp potion. It's good for 300 seconds. Uh, let's top off my food. Oh, maybe I'm in luck. Maybe I'm in luck. Can I make a, um... Oh, a cold poo-poo. I can't make a workstation here. We gotta, we gotta, we gotta make a trip back. We're chilling. <laughs> but not in the good way. We're chillying. Oh, is this the cave? Yeah, I think this is it. Okay, good. We're comfortable in the cave. Hmm. Hmm, good to know. Cave is, is, is safety. If we could find a cave down in the swamp, too, 
we can extend that safety. The reason why I built... I probably could have built the outpost much closer. The reason why I built it up there is because I was afraid the spiders would kind of attack and raid it. But... I don't know. I don't know if the, the trade-off was necessarily worth. Because now I have to run like a really long distance. But oh, but I'll um, I'll keep it the stuff that I need to make a fire and drop the fire as we go. Thanks, moth plants. I probably don't even need to do this. I probably have enough to make uh, the workbench and things of that nature. There's resin here too. The workbench and uh, use the fiber to make my band-aids, but I'm just going going um, base tier band-aids for now. We're slumming it. Let's go to the bottom. Wait, where are we at? I can make these in my inventory. I totally forgot. No, no, I, here we go. I, I'm wrong. I think I need to make them here. Okay, we got a plenty of band-aids. Let's empty this place of fiber and wood. Let's make sure we can build our workbench. I think I need resin for the workbench too, right? Yeah, we have enough. So we're just gonna go ahead and empty our resin store. Uh, no, no, we're gonna take the resin. Empty our resin stores. It's all gonna come with us if we die. It's operation kit recovery all over again. Cool. Let's uh, put a band-aid on. Can I make this? Let's let's put this to bed. I thought I could. Yeah, I remembered correctly. You cannot make them, but then I second guessed myself. Let's send it. All of the fiber. We'll just get more fiber along the way. We're gonna be out here for a little bit. Oh, the bees are back. Hey, Band-Aids, we're going to be consuming you a lot. Gathering fiber. Oh, the stalks are back. All right, I don't need to worry about fiber. The rice stalks are back. We're good. We are good. And I can make a campfire at any point because I have the wood and the resin. Thumbs up. Let's roll. All right, now that I'm better equipped, we're just going to full send. We're going, like, we're going deep down. We're going in. I want to look for that flint, like I mentioned. I think there's a spood right around this corner. Or was it bark that I saw? Let's use our bug vision. Oh, hey, there he is. I wonder if we tame the spood, if we can actually climb on walls. The wolf, too. I don't think you're going to give me... We killed three wolves and gotten no silk. Maybe I should wait till night to fight the nocturnal spiders. Yeah, no, that's four wolves and no silk. Huh. Now they're a little bit better outfitted. We're just gonna full send. So I'm down here back by the frog. I wonder if these candles give me any warmth. No, they do not appear to. So let's put a campfire down right here and we'll put a workbench. This will be my go-to spot for now. Warm me up. Let's make sure that I'm fully repaired. Bing, 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 bing. Uh, we could do a bed too. Why, like, why not? I'm, I'm making a little makeshift out. I got my crafting outpost up there. Uh, it's not. Nothing's gonna get broken. Hopefully, let me make um. Let me make a little survival outpost right here, and we'll set our spawn. Let's check out this bullfrog though. I uh, no, no no no. We're not gonna sneak. Too far out. Don't take forever. Just hope that he doesn't see. Uh, he's weak to pierce damage. Toad. How many? Should we? Should we send it? I have seven arrows. We don't. We don't send. We don't send. We come back for Toad. He seems like he's a mini boss. I. I I'm not. I'm not ready. <laughs> I I'm not ready. We still got to kill spiders. I've killed several of the wolf spiders that we've seen, but I haven't gotten any silk from them. So I'm wondering, I did get silk from the nocturnal spiders when we ventured out here at night. It's almost night now. I'm wondering if that's the play is to wait till night and fight the nocturnals. Unless we can kind of discover some more of the nocturnals as we go. What, what have I been getting from them? I've been getting... I got heads, uh, furs, and eyes. But no... Another wolf. Let's put it to the test. Hitter, we dodge. 
Oh, like, my stamp potion's gone. Poo poo. That doesn't last long enough. It's the last at least six times longer. Same as same as same. Oh, okay. I just kind of like just one main bandage. Silk, silk, no silk. Yeah, I think this is an. Oh, I'm, and I'm cold too. Let's go back to our fire. This is a nocturnal angle. There is bark for absolutely days out here, but I, I haven't found any flint. I've been wondering. The, the wolf spiders don't seem to be the guys that we need to go after, but black widows, which I think that's a black widow right there. Black widows and the nocturnals. And we're getting towards, yeah, we're about at night. Oh, dodge at the sound cues, remember that. And watch your stamp. Burn, spider, burn! Kill him with righteous fire! I gotta be really careful about fighting here. Especially with the, um... With the cold and the the spider venom and all this, like... It's just, it, it, everything's out to murder me. Did I get any silk from that one? I did, I got two silk. At least I think I got it from, I'm pretty sure I got it from that Black Widow. I haven't been getting it from wolf spiders, so... That is a, a good sign. Uh, if I see more or as night approaches, I might drop my next stand potion. Just wish it lasted a little bit longer. Or if I can get super lucky and kind of hit some plant. That that was a misplay, is not making the shears back at... Um... Oh, frog. What? 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 Why am I still poisoned? Did the water poison me? Band-aid up again. I think the water might have poisoned for science. There's no way, right? It was just the residual of the black widow venom. Oh shit! Black turtle! Out of nowhere! It was definitely the residual of the black widow venom. I just kind of like lost track of it. Hey, nocturnals are the worst. Roar! Freaking turd! Oh no! I need some venom sacks. What is that? What is that? A mosquito? Get out of here! I am dead. I got mosquitoed. Oh, come on, man. Come on. I good thing I put the bed down here. We're not. We're not far off. But I just. I didn't know mosquitoes were a thing until now. There's another one. What do you gotta give me, mosquito? You are apparently very tanky for a smaller flying insect. Santa. Oh, no, 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 no touch. Okay, what do we get? We got blood potion. Oh my god, what? There was more? What? I was yeah, very excited about the blood potion. All right, well, you, I, I have the home field advantage here, you turds. And I'm fighting you with a sword, and you're weak against blood. I don't have. Okay, we're just gonna keep. We're gonna keep working the circ. The, we're gonna circ the mosquitoes. Are there, those candles are definitely not citronella. Okay. I need to get my original body back. Uh, a sack of thick, dark liquid from a fallen mosquito. Home field advantage. I'm not even bothering to dodge here. I'm just full swinging. I'm a man of culture. Full swing, no dodge. Okay, they are dead. They are dead. Now let's go to our original body. Down here. And Operation Kit Recovery this. Uh, we got kit and we dipped. <laughs> we are we are not well equipped for battling the spoons. I think not getting the shears was a misplay. The good news is we are walking out of there with uh, enough silk to make the loom. Like I, I got two from that one Black Widow. Uh, we got three total. So we're ready to like 
make the loom at least this should allow us to advance and i think with that loom i can make the chitin axe which is a better piece of edged related damage than the flint sword so it's going to give me a edge when battling the spiders pun intended uh but i need to head back to the great tree in order to do that and doing this all in the cold is making things so much more difficult than I thought it would. So I may dabble into creating some of the cold resist foods while I'm back at base with any of the ingredients that I have. And we also harvested some of those poison mushrooms while we were down there uh, and fleeing for our lives. So it's a uh, poison resist brew angle 100% of the time. The good thing is the wolf spiders that we killed did give us what we need for making the poison resist brew and it is they didn't give us the silk well we can make the brew we can go back in there we can battle the nocturnals and the black widows those are the ones that give us silk and if the shears on the cocoons give us silk we're kind of like double double dipping in that regard so that's really really good i want to make sure that i we do that but uh we got we got some more minor preparations that we have to do before we can get that underway so back to base we go Back to the base we go. Free Butler. Tree Alfred. Pixie Alfred. Get me up there. I'm freezing, so uh, quickly would be preferable. So we got some heads uh, stored back at the outpost, too. We got a ton of eyes. We've got Yeah, we have a ton of eyes from the wolf spiders. Uh, 11 total venom glands. Insect fur. God, I just... My inventory needs a sort button. That's the thing that I need the most in my life. Root home. Warm me. Warm me, root home. Ah, oh, I'm comfortable. All right, so cauldron. Let's make this boiled poisonous mushroom. What does the spider stew? Is that eye? No, it's a head. Ooh, I don't want to use the head. Um, Because the head's for making the gear. Is there anything else? Blood soup? Uh, oh, I could do that. That gives me cold protection. All right, yeah. Thanks, mosquitoes. Insufficient materials. Oh, petals. I need... I have more of those stored. That's fine. Okay, let's make all those. Petals, 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 petals. I think you are around here in one of the... Oh, I need the flint, too. Uh, let's just go ahead and take you all. Yoink. Petals. Petals. We're going to get that... Cold, cold resist food, I underestimated you. I, I think we I think we need you. And thanks to these mosquitoes, we're gonna have plenty of it. All, right, all of my edible mushrooms have now been consumed. Uh let's make poison resist brew. Let's roll into the table as we make poison resist brew. Seed oil. I know we have a thousand of those laying around. It's my fibers and stuff. I have to go through every single chest. I tried to organize things and then forgot where I put everything. The curse of having the small chests, I guess. Uh, ooh, 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 ooh. Turn it around. So do we want the lesser, which is cheaper? It's negative 33% for 600 seconds or negative 60. So I have a like three out of four will not apply poison and then I can make the antidote if one does. Yeah, let's make two of them. And then... Oh, wait, no, I think it just reduces the damage by it, right? I, I We'll find out. Let's make one more, and... Let's hang on to the five, because I think I can make that poison mace, right? Uh, poison mace. Oh, perfect. With five. But we need the fiber string. All right, all right. Hang on. We're getting a bit ahead of ourselves. The fiber string should come from the loom. We can get some big upgrades going here. Big upgrades. Oh, I can taste it. We're advancing to the next tier. I'm building our loom and spindle. God, you were something to get, weren't you? Loom and spindle. Let's stick you right here by the by the uh, by the window. 
We can make a windmill, a flower wall light, and a standing. Oh, interesting. A lot of cool stuff can be made at the windmill. Let's dig, let's dig into it. A hook, a grapple gun? This might change my world. Fiber string and chitin. We have a lot of that stuff. Fiber string is just fiber. Textile patch is fiber and silk. Silk thread is resin and silk. Oh no. We're gonna need so much silk. So, 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 so much. Uh, can I make the grapple gun though? 10 fiber strings. I can make it, but my inventory's full. Let's, uh, let's eat this caramelized head. Yum. Now we have a space. Fiber strain, boom, 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 boom. Give me, okay, I got the 10. Boom, grapple gun. Okay. A tool for navigating the world which offers maneuverability at the risk of your well being. Careful. Hmm. I can make better beds. It, well, it's risking my well being, so we're putting it on there. You need to equip a hook to use the grapple gun. Okay, well, all right, all right. How do I make hooks? Fiber string and chitin. More of the fiber string. All right, let's just dump all of our excess resources. This is going to be a big session of crafting. Go add the one silk remaining over. Spider heads can go in. Spider eyes. I have a thousand of you. Because spiders seem to have quite a few eyes. Well, let's take the chitin. What did it say that I needed? Oh, 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 fiber. Let's go over to our fiber chest. Our stores aren't great, but we have a little bit. Turn most of that into stringies. Okay. Please tell me hooks are not consumable. They're consumable. Nuts. Robust chitin hook. Craft, craft large quantities to use the grapple gun. Need more fiber string in order to do that, but we're going to do this one for science. We're going to burn one. Need to equip. Oh, I didn't equip it. It needs to go in my arrow slot. Sorry, bow and arrow, where you're going in the. Oh, do I? Can I hold it? Yeah, you hold it. And you've got like it's it's all based on stamina. Hmm. So I can Tarzan mode this a little. Ah. Uh, why is it getting caught on stuff? Ah. Da, 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 da. This will pre help prevent fall damage. That's for sure. But I lose the ability to run bow and arrow. And my little stringies remain forever. It's cool. I'm going to run it. I think it's going to be more beneficial. I haven't been using bow and arrow that much lately anyway. So guess what's getting stored? Bow and arrow is going to the chest. We're grapple gamers now. Let's put it in these chests that don't have anything in them. Uh, bow, you can go. Arrow, you can go. Let's now make some other upgrades. Let's try to make that... Oh, the shears. Let's do the shears first before I forget. I will likely forget. Shears. We just need resin, and I just stored a bunch of resin. Now we are going to be able to harvest hopefully tons of amounts, tons of amounts of silks. Tons and tons and tons. Bum, bum, bum. Probably should have made those much earlier, but we've got them now, and that's all that matters. Back to the workbench. I want to try to make the mace. I think that's a big upgrade because it poisons the enemy. So insect stingers bark fiber string and refined wood, and it does blunt, pierce, and poison damage. Huge. And I also want to make the chitin axe. So... Oh no, silk thread. Ooh, I gotta get back in the trenches for that. Okay, we can't make that right now. But we got the shears, so we can go in there and hopefully snip snip. Poison mace, though, I know we can make. We got insect stingers, bark, fiber string. We'll make more of that and refined wood. I'm never gonna remember all that, so let's start with the uh, string. And refined wood. I think I emptied my stores for fiber. Yeah, we got nothing left. It should all be inside of me. So, I think it was two, it said make some extra just because we are using it a lot and we can also make a couple more hooks. Guess I can't combine that that way. There we go. 
Now we got 26 hooks to save us from any type of falling related damage or hopefully traverse the wilds a little bit easier. Uh, I'll store these boiled mushrooms. For poison resistance reasons. This is my blood soup that's going to keep me insulated in the cold. Uh, I don't know why I had firefly juice on me. Flint. Everything. You know what? I don't care. Everything's just going to go in random places at this moment. We need more of the, um, the refined wood. I got wood on me. I got to craft some of that down. Where's my... There it is. <laughs> Where's my... There it is. I think I needed 10. So let's double check what the mace requires now. Two bark and... Ooh, do I have the bark? And 10 insect stingers. I should have the bark. I don't think I used all of it on house creation, did I? Uh, four insect stingers. Oh no. Do I have to go fight bees? Insect fur? I have to go fight bees and get more bark, I think. Unless I... There's... I don't think there's anything in here. These are the new ones that I made. Oh no, we got bark. Okay, cool. Oh, one more insect stinger. Hell yeah. So we need five more insect stingers. And then we can make that. So let's just depot all my stuff into here. Because we're going to have to go out and, uh, and do that. Put that back on my six key. Seed oil or just inventory... Clean up management. Need more food too. We got three of these mush. Oh, this gives me actual food. Yeah, it gives me food and cold protection. We'll keep this as backup. The string can go in there. How's our inventory looking? Good. About as clean as it's gonna be. Let's see if we can repair everything, and then we'll head back into the wilds and try to get more of that silk. Repair. Oh, need wood for that. Good thing I got my backup firefly firefly torch. Where's my wood pieces? I know I should put you somewhere. <laughs> I, think, I don't think it's that one. There you are. Need to get wood on our way out. Oh, I need to go on a resource run. A good old fashioned resource run. How's our time? We're in the middle of the night. Let's sleep it. Oh, and then we're back. We're back into the fray, sort of. We'll go to our outpost, which is right in front of the um, swamp area. Put our spawn point there, and that's when we'll consume our cold resist food. Take me down, Paradise City. <laughs>